Hi, and welcome back to Talking About Golf. I'm Buddy Sash, your host professional here at the Ocean City Golf Club. And we thought we'd change it up this episode and talk a little bit more about instruction. Up to now, we've talked about different nuances about golf and some advantages and disadvantages and things. But today, let's talk a little bit about golf swing or getting ready to make a good golf swing. And so I thought what we do is talk about our routine and our grip and how are we going to get started to hit a great shot. So what I like to do when I'm playing golf and, and even when I'm practicing golf, I want my routine to always be the same. So what I'll do is I'll get behind my ball to the target, get myself aligned and make all my decisions. Is the wind blowing? Is the air heavy? Is there um, uh, special circumstances out by the green? And get all my decisions made. Once I've done that, I'm ready to move towards the ball and hit it. And for me, I try to make that happen in about the same time frame every single time. So I get behind my ball, I see my target, I made all my decisions, know what I'm doing, I've got the right club in my hand, and now I'm going to approach the ball. So I come up to the side, and here's where I take my grip. And I want to talk a little bit about the grip. The grip should always start with the club down to your side. You're going to put your left hand on it from the side, and get it in a nice position a little bit towards the fingers. Most golfers I find will move it towards the palm and I want it in the fingers. Then I'll raise it up, put my right hand on and make sure that the club is balanced. Once the club is balanced and square in my hands, I'll step with my right foot, put the club down, align to my target, and now I'm ready to hit the shot. Now everybody's a little bit different but that's your basic procedure to get ready to hit a shot. Now, when we get come back to our next episode, what we'd like to do is take it from there and go a little bit further with the program and test some key positions in the swing to make our golf swings more consistent, producing better shots. So we'll look forward to seeing you soon on the next edition of Talking About Golf.